Welcome back to the show. Thanks to Tim Elefante and Andrew Jaskowitz for the intro video. Alongside the very nervous Elisa Leone, I'm Lauren Abderholden, and thanks for joining us. Elisa? This week, we welcome in the winter season. The winter solstice is this Thursday and marks our shortest day of daylight during the year. This week's show is for the week of December 18th through December 22nd. We have a jam-packed show today, and it and is a touch longer with many holiday thank you videos. With our holiday cam on the street, so stay tuned for that video at the end of the show. Gentle reminder, this Friday, December 22nd, school is operating on a half-day schedule. School is back in session Tuesday, January 2nd. We'll be right back after the school safety tip video. Once the school day starts, do not open any exterior doors allowing entry into the building. All staff can swipe in, while all visitors and late arriving students must go to the main entrance and buzz in through the main entrance. A faculty member who is supervising the front door will then permit entry. Thanks to Ariana Cassiopo and the School Safety Committee. Here's another safety tip. Attention all drivers, as the weather turns colder and we start to experience inclement weather. Be mindful of wet roads that may cause slick conditions and drive carefully while on the roads. As we get started with announcements, please listen carefully as dates and meetings are subject to change. And be, and be sure to check in with your activity and club advisors. Or check the Kinalon High School social media platforms or district websites for any schedule updates or cancellations. The next few announcements are related to school news and informational announcements about things happening at KHS. Big shout out and congratulations to the Kinalon High School Student of the Week, Paige Hiroka. Awesome job, Paige. The Give Back Club is an organization here at KHS that recently held a large fundraiser with Shelter Our Soldiers. The Give Back Club spent last Friday night at the vet Veterans Home in Lyons, New Jersey handling, handing out care packages. 150 veterans received a care package from the club. Additionally, we brought four barbers to provide fees, free haircuts to veterans. Huge thank you to the Shelter Our Soldiers charity for working with us. Thanks to Ms. Egan for arranging the barbers, the Aiken family, and Ms. Reimars and Ms. Trapanese for helping with the loading and transportation of the care packages on a cold, snowy afternoon. The club is so grateful for everyone's assistance. The Student Council grams will be delivered by Santa and the helpers during Block C on December 21st. Here is a brief announcement shared with us from the Spanish National Honor Society. We'll be right back. Senora White would like to thank all the members of the Spanish Honor Society who contributed to the Dare to Be You holiday gift drive. Every member of the 13 families will be receiving a gift. Please know that you have made someone's holiday season a little brighter this year. Your constant generosity and compassion is humbling and inspirational. Never change. Muchas gracias. The note in Spanish read, Thank you for taking a little bit of your time for us. We will carry you in our hearts even though we don't know each other. Thanks to all involved in video assistant Easton Smith. Moving along. Up next are a few school activity and club announcements. Please listen carefully. Uh, excuse me, sir. I, I see you're busy. But, yeah, I'm uh, kind of busy. Have you ever stopped to think what we would do without... Without uh, what? I mean, you take a disaster like the floods in Louisiana. 
Whose job was it to go right in there with medical supplies, clothing, nurses? Well, I... And who were the people who pitched right in and did the work? Right. And listen, sir, who was responsible by charter of Congress for helping the welfare and morale of our servicemen and their families? Anywhere a soldier goes, who is there to help him? Why these same... Why these same ones? And, and wait a minute. How about accident prevention and first aid training? Who teaches your children water safety, conducts home nursing courses, trains volunteers to serve the community in emergencies? I get... Oh, oh, oh yes. And who provides blood that saves thousands of lives every year? Well, honestly, what would we ever do without... The Red Cross? Well, we couldn't do without the Red Cross. That's why it's wise to give to the Red Cross. KHS will be hosting a Red Cross blood drive Thursday, December 21st. The blood drive will be in the Old Calf from 1.30 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. Please see Mr. Souls with any questions. Attention all, the new school newspaper, newly named Colt Chronicle, will be distributing its first print issue, a 2017 holiday issue, on Thursday during lunch. Recently, producer Caroline LaValle caught up with the members of the KHS student-run Contemporary Choir Club. With more, here's the video report. Ariana Cassiopo, and I'm the senior director of the Contemporary Choir. I am Peter Davin, and I am co-director of the KHS Contemporary Choir. The Contemporary Choir is a student-run a cappella group. It's audition only. We are a four-part choir. We practice every week at least once a week, sometimes up to two or three practices, usually for about an hour and a half, two hours after school. Practice consists of us learning our parts in separate sections. We have four, four of them, sopranos, altos, tenors, and basses, and then reconvening and then trying to put it all together at the end. We usually do a couple lip trills or like five tone scales on vowels, and then we do our full scales as a group. Oh. to underclassmen would definitely be to audition for a contemporary choir if it's something you sound interested in at all. It's been the place where I've made some of my best memories in my four years at KHS and that participate in things that interest you because sometimes you don't realize what a big part they're going to play in shaping you throughout your high school career. Joyful, 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 Thanks to Caroline for that video and all involved. Staying with the music theme, we are proud to announce that the following KHS musici musicians were selected from over 400 students from across northern New Jersey for the northern New Jersey area band. Congratulations to all of them as well as to KHS band director Mr. Stroud, Evan Lane, Peter Davin, Mitch Polavoy, Morgan Fiesta, David Cohn, and Cam Faison. The following are several sports-related announcements. Please listen carefully. Congrats to the KHS boys and girls basketball teams for opening their season with wins. Attention student athletes, please listen to the end of, end of day announcements for, for any athletic practice schedule adjustment. Be sure to follow the KHS YouTube channel and live stream accounts, KHS website and social media platforms. On Twitter, follow the KHS principal, KHS underscore sports Twitter and guidance Twitter accounts for updates and more. Reminder, coming up is the holiday cam on the street. This week's show was directed by Matt Henyon. Our technical director was Andrew Joskowitz. Our video and graphics producer was Alex Arzosa. Our audio engineer was Damian De Toronto. Our script supervisor was Cleo Palace. Today's show was produced by the Advanced 2 class. Have a terrific holiday break. Be respectful, be mindful, be kind, and we'll see everyone in the new year. Here is our holiday cam on the street.
Uh, what's your favorite holiday song? All I want for Christmas is you. Can you sing it? All I want for Christmas is you. Santa Claus coming to town. Can you sing it? Santa Claus coming to town. It says it goes on for a while. The, the Italian Christmas donkey one. <laughs> that one's a really good one. A jig a jig hee-haw, hee-haw. The Italian Christmas donkey. What's your favorite holiday song? Probably The Grinch. <laughs> no. There's a, there's a song in The deep, Grinch. What is your New Year's resolution? It'd be to come to school on time every day. Just to be a better person inside and out, you know? To start my homework when I get home instead of at 11 o'clock at night. To survive 2018. Just make it into college. To be less sad. What's on your wish list this year? Oh, um, dirt bike and stuff and an Xbox One. A new computer. <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah. thankful that anyone's on A couple, couple more albums, Guns N' Roses, Aerosmith. A new car. Uh, an Xbox. Uh, cool. Coffee. Coffee grounds. <laughs> What's your favorite holiday cookie? My favorite, my favorite, my favorite, my favorite, my favorite holiday cookie? Chocolate chip, yo. I just like the regular, like, sugar cookies. <laughs> um, probably, like, chocolate chip. I don't really know the real name of them, but I have these Italian cookies my family always makes that are so good. Yeah, I don't know the name either, but it's like... It's like pretzel, caramel, chocolates. It's really good. <laughs> Sugar cookies, classic. No goofing around. Straightforward. Yeah. Name the 12 days of Christmas. Two, three, four, five. Is it, it's one. Just start with one. Um, a new car. No, that's not. It's a song. <laughs> uh, um, mm, a partridge in a pear tree. Swans, Swans rings, geese, geese laying eggs or something. Yeah. What's your favorite holiday movie? Home Alone, the first one. <laughs> um, was the Grinch? What's that? The Grinch. Yeah, the no. Grinch. <laughs> right. Elf. Die Hard. Either uh, the Grinch or the Charlie Brown Christmas. Santa Claus coming to town. <laughs>